Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome back to the Halo Forge Epidemic. I'm here with AJ UC. What's up, guys? This map name is called Orbital and Game Type Circumvention, and it's made by LZ Lagundo. And uh, this one's really cool. Um, Sam the Great brought this to our attention uh, one time in a custom game, and it's basically the main premise of it is keep away. And it's really cool to where you can only kill the the person who's carrying the oddball, but you your team wants to carry the oddball because it get it gets you more points. So um, it's really cool. You know, you have to communicate with your team and just pass the ball along and keep it away from the other team. Yep, and it does demand, I guess, a little more strategy than it would otherwise. Um, it does kind of look like it's just a, a mob type of thing here, but you do want to get open, spread out your team, because um, when you get chased down, everyone is going to come after you. So you want to make sure you do have those shots lined up, so if that guy is under pressure, you know, you can toss it to the corner, and hopefully that guy would have, you know, another buddy lined up. Uh, a cool thing about this is you can do interceptions if they try and do that, so uh, it, it's fun for both teams, I find. Yeah, and uh, I, what I do is, um, if the other team is about to throw it and I'm like right up in their face, usually just out of instinct, they'll jump first. So uh, whenever they're about to throw it, I always jump in their face and then I usually intercept it right there and then just go ahead, turn it around and uh, throw it to an open teammate who's out like on the other side of the map. And then, you know, we'll get a couple seconds on that and then, you know, pass it to someone else and so on and so on. Yeah, and you do have, as you can see right there, a little thruster pack that you can use. So that does help in... Uh in desperate situations, right when you grab the ball, you usually want to use the thruster to go in one direction or the other just because, you know, whenever you grab it, someone's going to be coming for you. Um, it's highly visible where the, go the ball is going, where the trajectory is going, so, you know, you're going to be on everyone's uh, radar, everyone's going to be targeting you. So once you get it, I would recommend, you know, just using the thruster and moving to the side right away. Yeah, and there's also like a, a hard light shield <laughs> option. Don't pick that. That's pretty much useless. <laughs> like we tried using that one game, and uh, thruster pack's the way to go, definitely. And I can't help but notice uh, right here. You, I don't think you have gotten the ball yet in this game, have you? <laughs> I had a kind of a tough <laughs> game. I was like that kid who was just standing there awkwardly in the basketball field. So pass me the ball, guys. Yeah, you're that guy. Or you're just standing <laughs> in the outfield, just waiting for the ball to come to. <laughs> I had like I usually have good games like me and Master Debates like Master Debates has never lost a game of circumvention he's lost to like his first game because he didn't know what was going on and you know me and him are usually on the same team most of the time and you know we just like pass it to each other and we're going like beast mode on these guys but as you see here this is like the first time I got the ball I don't know I was having a bad game this game <laughs> yeah um, and it is kind of cool with the new griff ball elements um Oh, wait, this is oddball. Never mind. Uh, when you kill someone yeah, it's with the same thing, yeah, it's basically the same thing. When you do kill someone with the sword, um, it automatically picks it up for you. So that's kind of cool. And also, unlike Halo Reach, you don't have to hold RB to pick up the ball. It'll just automatically get sucked to your hand, um, which does make for a faster pace game. Yeah, and uh, if you're getting confused on like maybe because it's a big open stadium, he does have the lights set up in the four corners, so you can see yellow, red, blue, and green. So you know if you go ahead and like turn around if you're open, wide open in a field, just go hey toss it over to green side, and then like the guy can look around and say oh yeah that guy's open at green. So that's pretty cool. Yeah, so these mini games you know they are fun and games, but sometimes we try or at least we pretend we pretend they have strategy. <laughs> yeah. Um, but yeah, guys, anyways, I hope you enjoyed. This is a definitely fun mini game you can play with any number of players. Um, yeah, thanks for tuning in. We'll see you guys next time. See you guys.